children here can, can see so very important property is this property of electric lines of force see i have drawn two lines of force lines of force mean it can be straight or curved lines of force represent direction of the electric field at that point here i have drawn two lines of force which are intersecting at the point p and it says they never intersect we cannot draw a field lines in this manner intersecting manner they never intersect that is a property and if they intersect what is the problem let us see that if they see if they intersect at this point p here we can draw two tangent to this curve we can draw a tangent to this curve also we can draw a tangent so if a unit uh, unit positive charge is kept here it can move in both the direction unit positive charge gives the direction of the electric field so if a uh, unit positive charge is kept here it uh, can move pa or pb along the tangent tangent gives the direction is it possible for a charge to move in two directions simultaneously at the same instant children is it possible not a charge for you is it possible to move in two directions at the same instant is it possible for no. you no it is not possible for you to move at the same instant in two directions it is not possible just like that the charge for a charge if it is kept here it cannot move in two directions simultaneously that means at the same instant it cannot move so it is not possible for a charge to move in two directions at the same time it is not possible that's why we say they never intersect each other this is the explanation for that so no two electric field line intersect each other why that is the question so what's the answer if they intersect that it will show two directions of electric field if they intersect it will give two directions of electric field and uh, for a, if a positive charge is kept here unit positive charge is kept here it has to move in these two directions simultaneously which is not possible understand so it will show two direction that itself is not possible two direction of electric field at the same point is not possible Okay, so that is, I think you understood explanation. Okay. So this, uh, all the properties study well. Then another property you see, electric lines of force are always normal to the surface, both while starting or ending. Uh, both the time they are normal to the surface. Understand? You, when you draw the field line, you have to be very careful. The field line must be normal to the surface. And diagram, I will show the diagram. Hold on. See, field lines are normal. We have to draw normal. Don't draw bend lines. Normal, always that will be normal to the surface. Whether it is here, here also they must be normal to the surface. Chart, hold on at this point normal to the surface it must but later they will bend but when it reach here they will be normal so electric field lines are always normal to the surface no component is along the surface of the body there is no electric field along the surface of the body they are always normal to the surface here also you have to draw like that at the reaching point they are perpendicular or moving point they are perpendicular normal to the surface so that property we have studied next a few lines contract longitudinally that uh, we explain then except lateral pressure and they are like charges there will be force of repulsion they accept lateral pressure and one more property is there all these properties are very important here this is another property here i have shown field lines Field lines. See, suppose it is starting from a spherical charged body, the field lines will be like this. And you can see when the when we keep a surface near to the body. Here the here is the body. Body I have not shown, only field lines are shown here. 
so somewhere near to it the body will be so charged body it will be near here so when the charged body is near the field lines are very very close but when they move you see move when they are far from the source charge when the field lines are far from the source charge what you can see they are far apart field lines are far apart when they are near they are very close the same field line you see they are far apart so that means if they are far apart that means the region is weak field we know electric field e is equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 q by r square inversely proportional to square of the distance so as as the distance increases field decreases distance increases force decreases field decreases and uh, uh, it is obeying inverse square law obeying inverse square law e is equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 q by r square denominator so r square is that inverse square law it obey that means as the distance increases the electric field decreases becomes very weak so when they are near to the charge the field is very strong and number of field lines crossing the area will be more so you have drawn two areas of similar uh, see similar area p and q are having same area but when the uh, field when the charge charge is near when the surface is kept near to the charged body the more field lines are crossing it that means the field is strong when the uh, area is kept far from it less field lines cross the surface that means the field is weak so just by seeing the field line you can see ah here the field lines are far apart the field is weak or when you see the field lines close what you can conclude children and the field lines are close what you can conclude strong field yes ah, strong field and they are far apart what's the meaning field weak. is weak yes that's all so that property also we have studied next is a very important topic electric dipole so for that i will first show a video then i will ask questions okay if we if we understood it's okay otherwise i will also explain it okay i will show a video because that will be more interesting that's why i am showing the video okay anything to tell excuse me ma'am yes tell me not here in who and network is weak i think i am not able to hear who is telling that is aditya aditya what happened aditya anything to tell there is a network problem Net, net problem. Ah, okay, okay. Net problem. Okay. You can inform me if net problem is there. No problem. Okay. Informing me. Okay. She is leaving. Okay. Net problem. But we also need to calculate the tension. But I think that we can very easily calculate now. Yes. Basically, it talks about the strength of the electric dipole. How strong is the dipole? How weak is the dipole? That, that comes out from dipole moment. Now, how do we calculate dipole moment? Product of... Okay. Let's focus. What is electric dipole? Di means two. So here we are talking about two charges which are equal in magnitude and opposite in nature. Yes. Separated by the volume. That is the So if one charge plus q, the other one minus q. If one charge plus q, the other one minus q. And the other one minus q. Charges separated by a volume. 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 Volume.
You can see, I will explain with this figure. Okay, that's better. A small distance is called This is maximum volume. What is dipole moment? So, dipole moment. you also get derivations so let's focus what is electric dipole di means two so here we are talking about two charges which are equal in magnitude but opposite in nature separated by a small distance that is electric dipole so agar ek charge plus yes you can see this figure have you heard of dipole children? Any chemistry class or any other class heard of dipole children? Teacher, I am Aditya. Aditya Yes. Okay, ma'am. Ah. See, this is the dipole. Here, minus Q plus Q, you can see. They are separated by a short distance. You see, just like atom. Atom, we know. Very small molecule of water, molecule of carbon dioxide. They are all dipoles. Their charges are separated by a short distance. So short and such a small distance it will be. So two equal and opposite charges separated by a short distance. That is known as a dipole. Two charges equal in magnitude but opposite in nature separated by a short distance. That is a dipole. Very simple one. What is a dipole? Two equal and opposite. One is minus q, other is plus q. Two equal, kanda, minus q. The other one is plus q. So that means magnitude are equal. But their sign, you see, one is minus, other is plus. So two equal, equal and opposite charges. And what is their separation? Very, very small separation. What is the example for dipole? That is molecule of carbon dioxide, molecule of uh, water etc are uh, examples such as atom molecule etc we know their distance is very very short but you know there there will be a charge separation in all molecule it will be it will not be like that so dipole means uh, two poles are that one is positive and other is uh, negative and they, their magnitudes are equal and they are separated by a short distance okay so that is about dipole. And then what is dipole moment? Dipole moment means it is a product of their charges and the perpendicular distance between them. Product of the charge. What is the charge? Q. What is the distance? Here it is D. Okay. The product of Q into D. That is the dipole moment. And dipole moment, you know, it is a vector quantity. Dipole moment and direction, the vector quantity we must know direct direction. Direction is minus q to plus q. That is the direction. So I will show the respective pages in our notebook. Oh. 
टू है दूसरा माइनस क्यू होगा अगर एक प्लस टू क्यू है दूसरा माइनस टू क्यू होगा ऐसे दो इक्वल एंड ऑपोजिट चार्जेस सेपरेटेड बाय अ स्मॉल डिस्टेंस इज कॉल्ड इलेक्ट्रिक जहां हम इलेक्ट्रिक डाइपोल की बात करेंगे वहीं हम बात करेंगे डाइपोल मोमेंट व्हाट इज डाइपोल मोमेंट सो डाइपोल मोमेंट बेसिकली वी आर नॉट एबल टू हियर ना सो वी कैन आई विल शो अदर पेजेस Yes. So here, you can see two equal and opposite charges, minus q plus q, separated by a short distance. Two a. Usually, uh, the distance between the charge is represented by two a, like that, like two d, like that. You represent. Do you know why? Because where for derivations and all. We have to take all distances from the center of the dipole. So, if we take a only, we have to take a by two. Then the relation becomes difficult. Distance of that point from the charge which will be a by two plus something like that. You have to write. So, it becomes difficult. That's so, all. In order to avoid that difficulty, what we have we are taking the distance between the two charges is taken as two a instead of a. We are taking two a. So what is the what is dipole moment? Dipole moment is product of either charge that is q. You can take minus q or plus q. Product of either charge into the distance between the two charges. Two a. Two a is the distance between the two charges. So uh, electric dipole consists of pair of equal and opposite charges separated by small distance. And uh, here we can see two equal and opposite charge minus q and plus q. And they are separated by a distance two a. So, what is the dipole moment, children? What is the dipole moment? Equation number three. It is a very important. What is the dipole moment equation? Okay. Ah. It is normally product of i element to the i that are here. Ah. Plus two to the i element plus two to the i element. Actually, any charge you can take magnitude, but direction we are giving in terms of the distance. This minus q to plus q is the direction because their magnitude, you know, I plus q minus q both magnitude will be a a q only, you know, magnitude of plus q or minus q that is q itself, isn't it? Mitra. Oh, yes, sir. So uh, q is the magnitude. And uh, two a is the distance between the two charges. Then we put the vector symbol because the dipole moment is a vector, and this direction, this minus q to plus q, that distance we have to take. Don't take plus q to minus q, minus q to plus q. Direction of dipole moment is from negative charge to positive charge. Understand? So vector p equal to q into two a. And uh, direction is from minus q to plus q. Then I will ask question: What is a dipole? What is a dipole? So the question is there. It is so that common sense. Now, now, land or the area, land, our 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 land, Aditya, what are the things around the law? Akshaya, Aditya, I am not hearing Aditya. What is the dipole? What is the dipole? No, I am not hearing. Adi Lakshmi, what is the dipole? Adi Lakshmi? Ah. Pair of? Ah. Pair of equal and opposite. Ah. Separated by a small distance. Small distance. Okay, very good. What's the direction of dipole moment? Direction of dipole moment. Do you know? If you don't know, you can tell I don't know. No problem. I'll ask you another one. Dipole moment direction. Ah. Tell me. Huh. Negative. 
negative charge to positive charge. Correct. Very good. Then, uh, Alok, what is dipole? If you are not responding, you have to write five times. Or answer. And you have to send it to me through WhatsApp. Alok, what is the electric dipole? No answer. I will call your parent. Abdul Krishna, what is electric dipole? What is electric dipole? Abdul Krishna also not answering. Manu Shankar, what is electric dipole? Manu Shankar, are you okay? No, no, ma, Mecha, tell what is electric dipole. Mecha. Mecha. Mecha KP, parayu. Mecha KP. Mecha KP, parayu. Samayang and the Wow, the car is really. Mecha, what is electric dipole? No, no, no. I'm going to pick another one. No, no, no. I'm going to pick another one. I'm going to pick another one. I'm going to pick another one. Yes, teacher. Huh. What is electric dipole? Equal and op uh -huh. uh, pair of equal and uh -huh. opposite uh -huh. charges uh -huh. uh, in between a small distance. Uh -huh. Separated by a small distance. Uh -huh. Okay, very good. Dipole moment P equal to formula tell product P of equal uh -huh. to uh -huh. Q uh -huh. to A. Uh -huh. to A. Vector P equal to 2 into vector 2A. Huh, okay. Type Very good. Like that, everybody should answer. Then only uh, you will understand the portions. Okay, next. Okay, but that uh, unit, or unit we have to study SI unit. Charge into distance. Charge. What is the SI unit of charge? What is the SI unit of charge? Gaudam, what is the SI unit of charge? Gaudam? Coulomb. Okay. Uh, Coulomb. Into distances. Gramia. What is the SI unit of distance? Gramia. Gramia. Uh, SI unit of distance. Newton. Uh -huh. Newton. Yeah. So, unit of distance. Distance in the unit are really. Length to length in the unit are really. So, unit. What is it? Length in the so unit are really. A long, long, long. Meet. Ah. I never had a number of other lay. Unit are less. So, unit are less than a number of the meter. Alpha and another da the mutter. You distance in the unity, a length in the unity, as a unity meter. Ah, for a task of the Kelly, my particular. Ah, I shall let the name of Rajam Bolimin Delia, a video on the Elia, an aversion. Apa, Columb meter, and a Columb charge unit. Distance, two is the distance between the two charges. Meter, column meter. But when you write here, CM, don't read it as centimeter. Children, it is column meter. As a unit of dipole moment is column meter. Next, one derivation is there. Very, very, very important derivation. Electric field intensity on axial line of an electric dipole. So, here comes the derivation part, a very important Electric field intensity on axial line of an electric dipole. So, I will show the next page. Each and every step you have to listen well. I will ask questions. And uh, at last you will get the uh, final expression for the electric field intensity due to a dipole. Apa, what we are finding? Electric field intensity due to a dipole. So, first you have to draw a dipole. This is the dipole. A, B. What is its name? A, B. A, B is our dipole. Well, which are the charges? Minus Q plus Q are our charges. Minus Q plus Q are our 
ചാർജ് മുപ്പത്തൊന്ന് ആളായി പോയി പോയി മുപ്പത്തൊന്നായി ഓക്കെ മൈനസ് ക്യു ആൻഡ് പ്ലസ് ക്യു ആർ അവർ ചാർജസ് എ ബി ഈസ് അവർ ഡൈപ്പോൾ മൈനസ് ക്യു ഈസ് കപ്റ്റഡ് എ പ്ലസ് ക്യൂ ഈസ് കപ്റ്റഡ് ബി ആൻഡ് ഒ ഈസ് ദ സെൻറ്റർ ഓഫ് ദി ഡൈപ്പോൾ സോ ദ ഇമ്പോർട്ടൻ്റ് പോയിൻ്റ് ഈസ് ഓൾ ഡിസ്റ്റൻസസ് ആർ മെഷേഡ് ഫ്രം ദ സെൻറ്റർ ഓഫ് ദി ഡൈപ്പോൾ സോ വെൻ വി ടെൽ എ പോയൻ പി പോയിൻറ്റ് പി ഈസ് എറ്റ് എ ഡിസ്റ്റൻസ് ആർ ഫ്രം ദി ഡൈപ്പോൾ ഇഫ് യു ടെൽ ലൈക്ക് ദാറ്റ് it means it is r distant from the center of the dipole that's the meaning p consider a point p at a distance r from the dipole along the axial line that is our derivation axial line means what you got just to join these two charges this is its axis and you extend that line that is the axial line so join the two charges and extend that line that is the axial line this is the axis and this is the axial line so you have to consider a point p along that axis which is at a distance r from the center of the dipole so in the figure explanation all these things you have to write first you have to draw a dipole ab minus q plus q o is the center then you have to consider a point p that is our question that is our derivation what is the electric field intensity at p which is at a distance r from the center that is the question so first you have to draw figure ab dipole and they consider a point p along the axial line which is at a distance r from the center of the dipole i think up to this it is clear to you isn't it children explanation is it clear where we are finding the electric field intensity where where we are finding the electric field intensity mohammad adil tell where we are finding the electric field intensity mohammad adil mohammad adil density where we are finding the electric field density where we are finding evade aanu where we are finding the electric field density at p where is p lying where is p lying vegam para samayangale und p evide agedukana where is p lying ah p is at a distance at a distance p at a distance r ah ah at a distance r from 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 o ah center of the dipole from the center of the dipole okay very good so here that uh, so figure explanation is that then next uh, what is the electric field density at p due to minus q charge electric field formula we know 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 q by r square that is the formula so at the p due to this minus q charge what is the field the equation tell uh, who will tell may i ka ka p tell what is the electric field density at p due to minus q charge formula varna adi tell the formula 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 q by no answer may i can tell 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 q by what is the distance from this charge to the point p uh, huh? is it uh, the, from this point to this c minus q to this point p what is the distance so up to center it is r so from a to o what is the distance 2a is the total distance so what is ao what is ao total distance ab is 2a o is its center so what is a small letter a correct so what is the distance from a to p what is the distance from a to p send up to this r a plus r a plus r r plus a okay so ap square distance square what it will be distance square q by ap square q by what is ap tell me please what is ap a Yes, R. Ah, R plus A, A plus R. 
whole square is there, a p squared. This is our formula, 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 cube by r square. Electric field is equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 cube by r square. So, that distance is r plus a. So, we have to write r plus a whole square. And its direction also you have to write e1. That is, a, this is minus q charge. We are keeping the positive test charge here to find the electric field density. That day I told you, in order to find the electric field density at any point, we have to keep a unit positive charge. So, we have kept, that is why plus 1 written here. A unit positive charge is kept here. Which direction this uh, test, this is source charge. This is a test charge. If this test charge will move in which direction? Nana, if we keep a positive test charge here, which direction it will move? It will, will it move along Px or will it move along Pa? Nana, if a positive test due to the force of this charge, due to the electric field due to minus Q charge, in which direction this positive charge will move? Nana, no answer. And where did the? What is your answer? Here we kept, here we kept a unit positive charge. Due to this minus Q charge, will it uh, have a force of attraction or repulsion? Due to minus Q, we are discussing about that electric field. Will it experience a force uh, attractive or repulsive? Unit positive charge kept here. Tell me. Repulsive. Positive, negative, we will repulsion. We will repulsion. Negative, we will repulsion. We will repulsion. I am sorry, teacher. Attraction. Ah, minus Q charge, plus 1 charge, we will repulsion. It will be force of attraction. Aana. Will it, which direction it move along PA or along PX? PA. Ah, along PA. So that's why this is marked here. Black, black line, can you see? That is vector E1. Vector E1 means the electric field intensity at P due to minus Q charge kept at A. Then we are taking the modulus of it. Modulus of vector E1 is equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 Q by AP square is equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0.